picks of the week. Okay, so my pick of the week is a downloading tool for Macintosh called Jaxta, spelled J-A-K-S-T-A, and that's at jaxta.com. Um, I believe it's like fifty dollars. Let me see here. It's it's not it's not inexpensive, but it is particularly magical because uh, oh, and they have it for Windows for also apparently. Uh, what it does is it runs in the background. You can toggle it on and off, and it will monitor media that comes across in your browser, including FLVs and flashes that you might want to download. So if you want to grab a certain, uh, I've done this for interviews, like grabbing interviews and news clips and stuff that I want to edit and cut up in Final Cut, uh, rather than trying to capture using a, a screen capture tool that's going to drop frames and tie up your CPU and have to do conversion and stuff, you, in many, many cases, not, uh, what would you call it, not uh, encrypted ones, like I don't, I don't believe it works with Hulu or Netflix or something like that, but for most FLVs and little clips of videos you find places, you know, embeds from the NBC player or something like that. A lot of those, uh, even HBO Go, I downloaded an interview uh, like a Bill Maher ex extra on HBO.com uh, uh, by accident. I went to play it. I think yeah. they did like their overtime segment. And I started, saw it, it, I saw it started the download in the background. And I was like, whoa, it even found that. Um, and you can download, uh, you know, the video that I made. I got a lot of my Justin.tv clips from downloading using Jaxta. So it is actually a great tool, you know, even tutorials and stuff that you want to just download and offload and watch later or put on an iPad or anything. There's always uses for this. Capture video of all kinds that is embedded. Uh, and that's at Jaxta, J-A-K-S-T-A dot com.